Good morning. It's 7.04. I left my house at 5.45. I'm at Air One. Um, I'm driving home. This is the second weekend in a row. Two out of three weekends. I'm going up next weekend too. But I'm going home. And I'm picking up a very special friend. I'm getting a roommate. So that's really exciting. And I'm just ready for a new source for me to give my love to in my life so they are moving in with me and i'm really excited for this relationship <laughs> and you're probably like Ella, you just got out of a relationship isn't this kind of soon i know guys i know but it's not what you think i just i really think that i'm i'm ready to move on in my life and no, this is not a rebound. This is this is true true love and affection. And my life is like a pie chart and everything is exactly the same except for the little bit of love and affection that I was receiving from the old relationship. And now I will be receiving that again because of this new relationship. So the pie chart is full again. And, um, you want to know their name? I'll tell you their name. Their name's Ash. Isn't that so cute? Ash. Like, fantastic Mr. Fox. Ash. I'm literally Ash. But, I'm really excited. Um, I have all their stuff in the back of my car. And, they, they're really particular about their sleeping situation. They like to sleep in this, like, like kind of like a box i guess you could say crate but like i don't know like that's kind of i don't know to each their own and they made me get this like thing for them to like put around their neck i was like whoa what are you into and then i got like a leash too i guess and like a little harness and then they said they needed pee pads for i don't know what but i was like okay so i got them pee pads I'm very excited. Um, also, if you didn't guess, get pranked, haha, -ha, sorry. I'm on like two hours of sleep, but I'm getting a dog today. Um, her name's Ash, well, her name's Wednesday, but I'm renaming her Ash. She's a three month old Aussie, Australian cattle dog and border collie mix. And she's like this little black, like little bean. She's so cute. She is so cute. I'm so excited. So I'm meeting her today for the first time. I'm rescuing her from Central Coast Cattle Herding Dog Rescue. Yeah, Herding Dog Rescue. Um, but yeah, I'm so excited. And she's going to be my new roomie. And I know that it feels kind of sudden. You're like, Ella, like, you're doing this. Like, is this another manic thing? You ran out of hair to cut. What are you going to do? No, it's not. Um, I've been wanting a dog since I moved. I moved down in January, and I said if I wanted a dog by the end of the year or by the time I renewed my lease that I would get one. Um, my lease expires in December, but we're expediting things a little bit based off of events that have happened. So, yes, it is a little bit from the breakup i guess but also like it just it made sense with the time because now it's like i'm not spending all this time with a boyfriend i have all this extra time in between school and everything and i only go to class three days a week so why not just have a little buddy so yep we're picking her up literally today at two it's 7 a.m i'm currently in calabasas so i have a couple more hours of driving i'm gonna get some breakfast and then we're gonna go to get her. I'm so, I'm so excited. I'm ready for motherhood. I'm ready for motherhood. Okay, bye guys, I'll stop yapping. Okay, a smoothie taste test. Some guy in there told me it's the last day of summer today. Isn't that wild, guys? It went by really quick. Anyways, I got the maca bomb, but I had a banana. Never had this one, but I wanted banana. This is really good. You guys should get that. You really should get this. You know the drill. Fuck, I hit the back of my throat. This is vitamin C if you didn't know. 
I do feel like I'm getting kind of sick. Like, I'm congested, but just in one nostril. I'm like, why am I sick? I'm like, maybe because I'm riding my bike in the freezing cold every morning, and also, what's happening? I'm wearing overalls, and this is a tangled mess. Um, and then, like, not sleeping. <laughs> I don't know. But, <laughs> we prevail. Whoopsie! Okay, bye, guys. I'm gonna punch it home. I'll see you at home. I call Cayucas home when I'm down here, but I call... Laguna home when I'm in Cayucas. I don't know. Oh, I also got pumpkin bread. They do a taste test. Every time I go in there, I'm like, I want pumpkin bread, and I never get it. I always get something else, and I'm disappointed that I didn't get the pumpkin bread. That's fire. face and it said slow equals thumbs down then it looked like a pink and then he painted his full face blue and then I took glitter and I chucked it and I got it in his eye. <laughs> Happy um, Sunday. It is like three o'clock in the afternoon. I'm doing some schoolwork, but I yeah I haven't really been doing much today. Kind of just like random miscellaneous errands around my hometown. But so I haven't really explained what's been happening. So I got a puppy, as you obviously know. Her name's Ash. She's a girl. I named her Ash after Ash and the Fantastic Mr. Fox because whenever someone asks me what movie character I identify most with, I say Ash. I literally like, like through and through. Anyways, that's besides the point. So I have been wanting to get a dog since I moved because I couldn't bring Pfeiffer because um, she would hate Orange County. She's not an OC girl. No, she would just be really stressed, I think, if I moved her environment because she's such, like, a pack dog and she obviously is used to having, like, everyone in my family around her at all times. And so, she just peed on the spot where she's supposed to pee. So, it's like, she's so smart. But anyways, I've been looking for a dog and I said if I, um still want a dog after when I renew my lease then I'll get a dog and so my lease is a year long 
So I, it hasn't been a year, it's been nine months, but due to uh, certain events, um, I was feeling pretty down in the dumps. And even before that, I was just, I was just not Ella. Really, I think I lost a lot of sight of myself and was just pretty out of touch with everything. And as those feelings kind of um, started to take over my life, I think I drew back into myself and isolated myself emotionally from important people in my life and that kind of caused a lot of destruction. Um, yeah, so that was not good. That was kind of all this summer. Actually, like, starting like May. I think I just like overwhelmed myself too much with school and work and just life. And I'm really hard on myself. And so, yeah. Anyways, that proceeded to basically disrupt my relationship with my family, my personal relationship in my life, my relationship with myself. Um... So yeah, I turned into like an insecure little mess. Anyways, um, since then, I've been doing a lot better since school has started and just kind of a lot of wake up calls. Um, I think this breakup was a big wake up call just for me to check my shit and be like, you can't love somebody else if you don't love yourself. That's kind of what I've been telling myself. And so anyways, I, um, so that's been like two weeks since that and i just kind of was like you know what i'm gonna get a dog like i think i have all this love to give in my heart and everything in my life is exactly the same except for this extra space of love that i'm obviously not giving to my family and i was like hmm, what can i use to fill that void not even like i'm filling a void because that's that's toxic and you shouldn't you shouldn't adopt an animal for that reason but I think I, I just need a companion. Like, I was fully expecting to not be living alone again at this point in the year. Um, but I am. <laughs> I was expecting to have, like, people be around me. But I am living alone. And I'm like, I need someone to share a bed with. My bed's huge. So, anyways, um, I got Ash. I rescued her from Central Coast Herding Dog Rescue. Um, she's three month old Queensland healer border collie mix and she is literally the most perfect dog ever She reminds me so much of Pfeiffer when we got Pfeiffer um, Yeah, she's just a little baby so I, I don't know she's literally perfect and I instantly like Like I was meeting with other dogs last week when I was up here too I drove up because she was on the central coast obviously so I drove up to my parents house, but um I was like meeting other dogs and I was like, like potential adoptions. I was like, no, it's just, it's gonna click when it clicks and it's gonna, like that's what happened with me and Pfeiffer. And I'm like, okay, I'm just gonna know when it's right. And she, she is right. It just, yeah, we're like, like this already. It's been like 24 hours, but um, she's gonna come live in Laguna with me and she's gonna be a little beach Orange County girl. Um, yeah, no, I don't really, again, don't really go to class that much. Or, like, my days are pretty staggered, so she'll always, she'll belong, she'll be left alone as, like, three hours max. But, um, yeah, anyways, that's a little update. But today we got her, like, food and, like, a bunch of random little miscellaneous things. I've been buying a bunch of dog stuff recently. Um, yeah, but home's been good. This time of year is really nostalgic to last year, and last year was really good at this time of year, and I'm just trying to not dwell on the past and just keep kind of going forward because life turned around so quick for me once, so it obviously is going to turn around quickly again, and you have to kind of have, I always compare my life to one of those like Hot Wheels like wind up cars where you have to like pull the car back to launch it forward. So right now we're just in the drawback, but we're slowly, slowly moving forward. Um, but yeah, I really do think like a little piece of my heart like healed. Like it's not in as many shambles anymore. It's in a dustpan now, guys. Don't worry. 
Anyways, I'm stressing because I have this whole illustration assignment due tomorrow, and I just, like, am being so reluctant to do it right now. I, I literally can't, and I also need to edit a video because I keep telling you guys I'm gonna post, and everyone's commenting on my TikTok, like, we miss your vlogs, and I'm like, guys, I want to post them so bad. I just, like, I'm just very unmotivated, but I think the more I film, the more I'll want to post. And I just, like, I don't even know if I want to look at that video. Well, it's going to be posted by the time you see this one. But, like, the footage from that is, like, more raw and, like, how I was feeling. I don't want to even revisit that. Like, I don't even want to, like... He still has, like, my house keys. And I kind of need that back. But I don't even want to open up a conversation because it's just going to hurt. I'm not going to put that in. I'll stop. Anyway, bye. Can I go potty? Can I go potty? Hello, hello. Hi, hi. Oh. Hey, freak. You go potty? Please go potty. We gotta hit the road. Can you go potty? We gotta go on a road trip. Come on, Ash. Can you go potty? You gotta get used to that too, dude. I'm sorry. Please go potty. Please. Please. We're driving home today. It's like seven right now. Um, Asha's first road trip. I don't know how she's gonna. Actually, was doing good in the car. Um, the last couple of days, but. This is like four hours. We'll see. Okay, I'm so tired. I woke up at five to Dixie. I, was, I sleep on the couch when I'm home. I woke up at five to Dixie literally like yakking. So I like put her outside and I had to take this dog out and then I just been up since five. Can you go potty please? Go potty. Um, but Dixie was making like mouth noises all night. And, like, I, like, have, like, misophonia. And so, like, I was, like, tweaking out. I was, like, please shut up. And I'm, like, I'm, like, hyper aware, like, making sure, like, Ash doesn't, like, need anything. Uh, it's so cold and tired. Bye bye. Um, we're, like, hour and a half, two hours in. And, like, almost to Montecito. But she's doing good. She slept on my lap, like literally right here the whole time my, my body's like cramped from like tilting over. Um, and now she's chilling in her bed. So hopefully she stays there through LA because I don't really want to deal with the 405 traffic with her on my lap. But we're gonna take a potty break in Montecito. The crate's back there. She's not stepped on the crate. I'm so tired though, I'm like trying to keep my eyes open. I think I'm gonna stop at Starbucks and get a pumpkin cream chai. That has like a chokehold on me right now, it's so bad. I've spent so much money on fucking pumpkin cream chai. If you order it with a double shot of espresso, I recommend. And I get it with almond milk, so then it doesn't just taste like milk water. Okay, that's my tangent. Bye. Okay, guys. Oh, we're looking so rough. I'm so fucking tired. Um, I'm driving down Laguna Canyon now, so I'm almost home. Home in like 10 minutes, but try been good. Went to Air One. Tried to get Ash to go pee. Didn't want to pee. Um, I got the same thing as Air One as I did on my way down. I'm hyper fixated on their pumpkin bread. 
Um, yeah, so that's basically it. I'm feeling pretty good mentally. My lips are so chapped. The stuff I'm using on my face, I'm using this like retinol stuff. It's like through my per dermatologist though, so it's like gnarly. It's like prescription and it's drying the fuck out of my face. Also, Cayucas is like super dry out right now, and so like my skin is so dry. Is that a cop? I don't know, guys. I'm so tired and I have class tonight. Um, but yeah, I'm good. I'm feeling good. I'm excited for this life with this thing. She's currently sleeping in her crate behind me. I had my arm like wrapped, this arm that I'm holding camera with, like wrapped around the seat with my hand like in the crate. And she was just resting her little chin on it. And I was just driving like that. And I was like, this is not real. Like what? What the heck, guys? I'm so excited. Um, yeah, mm, I'm gonna go home, unload my car. And then I need to drop a bunch of stuff off at the post office. I'm gonna take Ash down to Main Beach for the first time. So we'll see how she likes that. I don't think it'll be, my skin is so dry. I don't think it will be too crowded because it's a Monday, but yeah, it'll be fine. I just hope the tide's like, okay. Mm. Yeah, that's about it. I'm like so delusional in my life right now like I don't know I'm feeling like super delusional and reading into too many things but in a good fun way but just like feeling slightly delusional um but it's good and also like this yesterday was the first time in like a really long time that I've genuinely like smiled so hard and had like like a, it's just like a different feeling of a smile versus the, like okay you're happy and like forcing it like I swear since like maybe the beginning of the year is the first time I've like genuinely like yeah smiled so that feels really good um yeah I, things are moving up things are moving up moving up and on and out yeah but i keep getting blisters from my shoes from driving that's pathetic oh it's 82 at the butt okay <laughs> bye guys i'm kind of stressed because she won't pee like i took her on a walk i've taken her pee like five times she won't pee so this is the setup in the kitchen this is like blocking the door it's the crate a bed and there are two pee pads and food and water i'm gonna be back in like two hours so she'll be okay i just like you good this is so hard guys okay bye ash baby i love you go take night nights motherhood is not for the week just tired and unmotivated got up at four with the dog she went pee she went pee in the house she also went poo outside so today's been a win no nothing in the house as of now um and then i went on a ride i went to trader joe's and then i came home and then we i took ash to the beach 
She's such a little weirdo. She just like sits against the rocks. Like she's still like so sleepy puppy. Um, and then I would do laundry. I'm procrastinating cleaning my house that I really need to. And I also need to do like actual like computer homework, but I didn't want to. Um, this like doesn't even focus on my face. Hello. Um Yeah. love um yeah i like have been like standing here staring at the laundry on my bed for like 20 minutes now but i think it's done for now how much time good morning lovers and friends say good morning <laughs> it is currently 6 30 I've been driving. I woke up at 4. I was on the road by 4.30. Um, don't ask me why. I don't know. I couldn't tell you. But I just got Starbucks. And I'm in Montecito. So I have like two hours left. She's been knocked. Dude, some guy like in a semi almost hit us. And I braked and fucking Ash like flew like from here. Like down in here. Like just in the bed. Just fucking shot like zoom that's so funny. I feel so bad. But everyone clapped for Ash. We had no accidents in the house yesterday. Applause, applause, applause. This is so slay. Okay, I'm going home. Um, I'm eating. I made pumpkin banana bread yesterday too. She's gonna like tweak for this. It's like a big little muffin. So, I'm gonna eat that and um hit the road and I'm gonna be home like before 10 which is really cool okay bye okay guys eight o'clock I'm in slow so like 20 more minutes um I'm so freaking tired though my eyes like I'm like like this and I was like going like this with my head on the, the seat to stay awake Ash was looking at me like I'm freaking insane. She was on my lap for like an hour just like sitting there and I'm like swerving. Oh my god, it's so bad. But um, yeah, we're basically almost there. I'm tonight? Yeah, fucking tonight. <laughs> um, my grandpa is having like we're having a birthday party for my grandpa at my parents' like hotel. And um that's tonight. And it's like actually like a party party. And so um I'm gonna be awake for that and then I'm sleeping at my parents house with all my cousins tonight who are all younger than me it's just gonna be like crazy um so today is like a double yerb kind of day I got a chai at Starbucks I honestly don't know if that even has caffeine in it so I don't know but um, yeah that's about it I want to go thrifting really bad so I think when I get home I'm gonna take Ash to the beach and then I'm gonna go to the thrift store maybe and get a yerb. We'll see. But I'm like so tired. I just wanna close my eyes. And I was like, oh no, like I'll get up early and I'll be like awake and stuff. No. I know. But it's nice. I literally just made it up here in like four hours, which is insane. Usually it's like four and a half, five. So how do you feel? She's, I've like been screaming um, to no doubt and I've been slamming my head on the seat. She's like, my mother is insane. Uh, uh, this is fucking all crap. Oh my God, what are you doing, buddy? What are you? All the freaking cow poly kids are back and none of them know how to drive. <laughs> I'm not a poly student, guys. I'm not a poly student. I got toodles. I'm best to ever. I'm on Spotify, guys. Who's my temper? You're the only one. Um, we're walking to the party. 
Ellen and I are, are gonna have a great time. And it's gonna be really good. And I'm praying Ash doesn't piss in the crate. Say. Also, feel like I'm dying because I'm so woke up at four. Mmm. You'll be alive tonight. How do you? Are we gonna be in the vlog? Yeah, if I ever Put post it. I vlog. How do you feel about him? Just so scary. Holy shit. How do you feel about this party? Um, I'm feeling like I want to go home. Rate the candy on scale. Oh, yeah, we're gonna do a candy taste test. Of it. Wait, don't eat it yet. Alright. What is this? A strawberry fish. Is this better? It looks. Yeah, it looks better. It's not boobs. I would like to the boobs. <laughs> I like boobs. <laughs> 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 It's kind of good. This is not good. This is like wax. Nice catch. It's like bad breath. Ew. Ew. I give it a 6 out of 10. I give it a 4 out of 10. Like I'd eat it again. But like and bad. And here's a bad breath. I Do you want this? I want a margarita. A hot margarita. Yo. We forgot about the vlog! Hi vlog! <laughs> Yo, shut her. Shut her. Big thing. She's not in this. I'm not in this. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Leave it out. It's 7.52. 7.52. Oh, why? I am in the clouds. <laughs> Fuck. There's like. I just like if one more person asks me. How matter, school, matter, school is going, school. and then tells me they remember when I was this big. <laughs> I'm going to scream. But anyways, uh, the, there's tears have been shed tonight. Tears have been shed. Happy oh, and sad. That's not. <laughs> and Nico. wait, Nico, bro. And there's no birthday cake. How do you feel about there being not a birthday cake? Um, I think it's pretty sad. I think it's, it's pretty, pretty amateur. Pretty amateur. And for wow. Ella. Note to self, you have to post this vlog. Dude, I have to edit this. I have home. Um, hey. I drove back at 7 this morning. Me and Ash have been home for a couple hours. About to take her to the bathroom. And then go to school. Holy shit, I look insane. Ah! Anyway. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. Hey guys. Anyways, what I was saying is um, me and Ash left at like 7 this morning. It's Monday, by the way. And we drove back here. It took like four and a half hours. And then we went to the beach here. It's really foggy out. But now I have class. I'm going to take this lady to the restroom and put her in her crate. Please don't do this on camera. Oh, my God. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I promise I will post more of my life. I'm saying this as I haven't even posted a video for two weeks ago. But we're okay. Ow, you little turd sack. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, bye, guys. I love you. <laughs> Cut the cameras, cut the cameras. Ah!